Hi lovely viewers, it's me again your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. Bulldozer's baby mama submits that DNA tests on her four children may be tempered with. Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. A dollar based woman who claims that Kabushi PF member of parliament Boman Lusambo, father of four children, has submitted that there is a high likelihood that the deoxyribonucleic acid DNA test to ascend the children's paternity may be tempered with. Messi Koham in an affidavit filed in the Lusaka High Court in support of Lusambo's application for the four children to undergo DNA tests, stated that while she did not wish to oppose the application for a paternity test, she was deeply concerned about the safety and security of the DNA samples and where they would be taken for testing as there was a high likelihood that the same may be tempered with. Given the media attention this matter has attracted and the many parties interested in the outcome of the case. In the premises, to ensure protection of DNA samples and entire DNA testing process, I am of the view that the same should be a court-supervised DNA test where neither myself nor the plaintiff will know the laboratory chosen to conduct the DNA test except the court and the results will only be communicated directly to the court, Maisie stated. She added that she was agreeable to a paternity test to be carried out as it would help prove that Lusambo is the father to her children. I am willing to contribute towards the expense of the DNA test, which expense can be communicated to the parties by the court once the court has appointed the institutions that will conduct the DNA test, Messi stated. And Messi stated that it was not true that Lusambo did not know her at all because they have known each other for a very long time now. I have been in an on and off sexual relationship with the plaintiff from 2014 to date and it was during this time that the four children I have with the plaintiff were conceived, she said. During the subsistence of our relationship, the plaintiff and I would meet at Ingweshi Lodge in Indola. But sometime in 2017, the plaintiff rented a house for me in Kansenshi and Indeke area in Indola, and he would occasionally visit me. Last month, Lusambo filed an affidavit in support of an application for a paternity test. He stated that a DNA test was the only sure way that the paternity of the children would be ascended and prayed that the order for DNA be granted in the interest of justice. More news to come my lovely viewers, make sure you subscribe to this channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and also turn on the bell icon to join the notification squad. For now, I'm out. Alright, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you. Peace. I gotta go.